Hello everyone. I wish we were all together to celebrate 60 years of research at Gombe, but I guess we're getting used to zooming in and having these virtual meetings. So it really is exciting. And in addition, of course, today there's all this um, innovative technology from DNA analysis to satellite imagery that's used in the study of chimpanzees in different study sites. And this will be discussed in detail, I know, later. And especially exciting to me is the variety of research topics that are being covered in this symposium. Can you imagine how fantastic it is for me to see so many topics that I speculated uh, about in the early 60s and were seen as heresy, anthropomorphizing by the scientific community back then. And now it's discussed just as a matter of course, things like individuality and emotions, tool using and making, culture, primitive war. All of the above and more were considered back then unique to us, although Charles Darwin would have disagreed. It's fantastic to me to see how useful much of the very early detailed record that was made at Gombe with just a couple of research assistants who weren't even, um, they hadn't even got scientific degrees. And yet that information has been used by other scientists, has been pulled together, thanks a lot to, to Anne Pusey, and it's really contributed to our understanding of chimp behavior. And now that data, safely stored in Arizona State University, it'll be increasingly available to other scientists. I think it's true that the data from Gombe and now other study sites as well, it emphasizes the value of long-term research, the importance of following individuals through life, looking for family traits, seeing how new tool using and feeding behaviors are introduced. The Gombe data also illustrates um, the tremendous importance of descriptive notes and not just, uh, you know, statistical data, because little incidents, perhaps only seen once and written off as mere anecdotes, they may provide significant insights and help us to understand puzzling aspects of chimpanzee behavior. A special word of appreciation to the Tanzanian field researchers from villages around Gombe because they know the individual chimps so well and the terrain and they've provided long-term continuity as researchers come and go. Finally, we've been able to continue thanks to the support of the Tanzania Wildlife Research Institute, the Tanzania National Parks and the Tanzania government and of course, the people of the local communities. So I know this is going to be a really exciting symposium and bye from me.